put punches together. He likes the combination punch of hit. He takes a hard right hand and a stagger. Here comes Enrique's in to try to do some damage and follow up, and he does, but when... Isa sa pinakapaboritong fighter ng Hong Kong ay ang palaban na si Rex Chu. At bago nga sumikat ang batang ito mga bay, ay sa mga Pinoy fighter humugot ng experience at ang Pilipinas ang unang bansang denayo para mahasa ang kanyang kakayahan sa pakikidigma sa ibabaw ng ring. Halos lahat ng nakalaban ng fighter na ito ay no match sa kanyang galing sa pakipagbakbakan hanggang sa makalaban ulit sa isang Pinoy noong Marso 7 taong 2015 sa Macau at ang labang ng ito ay para sa bakanting WBA International Super Flyweight title. Bago ang lahat mga bay ay huwag kalimutang pindutin ang like at subscribe button at na rin ang notification bell para maging updated ka sa ating mga bagong videos. Corner, ang Pinoy warrior na ito mga bay ay walang iba kundi si Michael Enriquez na taga Cagayan de Oro City at may kartada itong 10 wins with 6 knockouts na may dalawang talo at isang draw. At ang undefeated wonder kid ng Hong Kong ay si Rex Chu at may malinis na kartada itong 15 wins with 9 knockouts. I want you to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourselves at all times. Now touch gloves. Good luck to both of you. Ito ang kauna-unahang laban ni Rex Chu mga bay sa ilalim ng pamamahala ng top rank. At ito rin ang kauna-unahang laban sa Hong Kong ng ating kababayan na si Michael Enriquez. Dito pa nga lang sa unang round mga bay ay nagpakitang gilas agad itong Hong Kong Gis sa harap ng kanyang mga fans. Napaka-agresibo nitong kalaban mga bay at napuruhan ang Pinoy sa unang round pero palaban at matibay itong si Enriquez at hindi papayag na maliitin lang ng ibang lahi. Come here not to fold up and tell you that. This round so far. Good come. Cho has managed not always using it though in this fight. He's putting himself into punching range, which is not unusual. He's long armed. She can hand speed, excellent combination puncher. And a lot of them are here. Round number two. The so far and Enrique is really giving as good as he's been taking in this round and he is fighting hard look at this little whirlwind go to work great exchange terrific flurry by both sa pakikipaglaban ng husto ng Pinoy mga bay ay hindi magamit ng kalaban ang kanyang reach advantage mabilis man ang kamay ni Rex Chu ay nagagawa ni Enrique na paatrasin itong Hong Kong Gis Here, 
Vasquez just has no problem in bringing the fight to Cho. It's fine with him. Hey, this kid wants to fight. And Cho answers back with a straight left hand. Good left hook by Enriquez. Put punches together. He likes the combination punch a hit. He takes a hard right hand and he's staggered. Here comes Enriquez in to try to do some damage and follow up, and he does, but when Enriquez goes down, he takes a hard left from Cho. It was the greatest moment of the fight for Enriquez. And he got caught that hard left in one day. Tonight too, aren't we? My goodness. Both of these fighters have been hit with a lot of clean punches. The legs giving way of Enrique, but he still does on. I'll tell you, I think this fight already screams for a rematch regardless of who wins. Rear jab. Right uppercut from Cho, overhand right from the strider of Cho. Staying within punching distance, and that seems most of the time to be all right with Rex. Hey! Sobrang dikdikan talaga ng laban na ito mga bay, at bumagsak na ang ating kababayan sa nakaraang round. Pero ito'y patuloy pa rin lumalaban, at hindi alintana ang pinsalang nagawa ni Rex Chu. Right hands to the body by Joe. Who really? Round one. Triple the body. The question is, is Joe doing Enriquez a favor by engaging him inside? Enriquez using his shoulder. Rex has what vision to at super flyweight fight the way he's just standing there in the pocket. He needs to pop some right on the chin. Good right to the body, ripped by Cho. Enriquez, a little bit awkward there and wild with his overhand right. Medyo bumagal ang dalawang fighter nga na ito mga bay. Pero ni Minsan, ang Pinoy na si Enriquez ay hindi umatras sa kahit anong angulo ng pagpapalitan ng suntok. Such a great event. See who can keep up this pace in the second half of the fight. What would seem to be a war of attrition, although both seem to have plenty of... Good left. So again, electing to stay close. Now pushing him into the corner. Let's see if he rip it. Open a combination. Crowd encouraging him to do just that. He seems to have Enriquez where he wants him. Elbows him into the corner. Enriquez trying to Look right to the body. He just likes being inside. There's no doubt about it. He's, he's enjoying the combat, wants to engage, but it's costing him at times. And he just again got caught with another shot, got caught with another left hook. Left hook and a ripping right by Enriquez, who's indefatigable. And despite numerous physical. Seems a little bit. Ten seconds. Laktaw tayo dito sa round 9 mga bay, kung saan dito natin makikita ang lakas ng stamina ng Pinoy. Habang itong Hong Kong gis na si Rex Chu ay halatang kinapos na ng hangin at palagi na lang yumayakap tuwing aatake si Enriquez. Still coming forward. Cho trying to use the ring a little bit. Maybe should have been thinking. At least in the work of the way in. see them around the press conferences. They're all very friendly. Enriquez working to the body. Both men still working hard here in round nine. Without 
some of the effect of this, but Enrique still pushes forward. They're still each trying to almost push each other back. Last round na tayo mga bay. At dito nga ay bubuhos ng dalawang fighter ang lahat ng natitira nilang lakas. Kung saan si Enriquez nga ay may malaking porsyento pa ng enerhiya na natira. Habang ang kalaban ay puro yakap na lang. At umaasang matatapos na ang round at makapagpahinga. The combination by Cho. High volume of punches in this fight. And a busy Hard right hand by Enrique. They, they had a chant going up here for the Wonder Kid from Hong Kong, but uh, Enrique silenced him real quick. And another strong combination. And he's finishing the stronger of the two. Look at little Enrique go and Cho trying to find the answer. And Cho always says he wants to bring excitement to the ring. Sometimes it takes two to tangle, and we've had two tangling here tonight. Crowd into it. Final seconds. Cho unleashes a flurry. As Enrique's up against the rope. Crowd letting him hear it. Final bell. Terrific. Natapos nga ang napakagandang laban na itong mga bay sa isang unanimous decision. At pakinggan natin ang scorecard ng mga horado. Dahil kung hindi bumagsak ang Pinoy sa round 4, ay di hamak maging draw pa ang laban na ito. Ladies and gentlemen, after 10 rounds, the official scorecard reads as follows. Judge Feldman, 95-94. Judge Lagumbay, 95-94. And Judge Hoyle scores it, 96-93. All three in favor of the winner by way of unanimous decision. And now, WBA International Super Flyweight Champion. From Hong Kong, China. Daghang salamat mga bay at hanggang sa dulo ay hindi pa rin kayo bumibitaw. Nais ko pong malaman ang inyong reaksyon sa ating video. Pakicomment na lang po sa baba at babasahin po natin yan. Daghang salamat, mabuhay tayong lahat.